What's up, everybody? Go Burns about to break down the latest trailer from Mafia 3 regarding Lincoln Clay, the soldier. Now, what's interesting is this wasn't the only Mafia 3 video that was posted this morning. This came up about the same time as this short live action video. And obviously, it's been pulled from both the Twitter and the Facebook pages of Mafia. But there was like a little 30 second teaser for it over here on Mafia on the Twitter page. But then, but then there was a much longer version of that live action video over on the Facebook page. I think it was like two or three minutes long. But anyways, it must have been a premature posting on Mafia 3's part. So that little video will probably go up maybe sometime this week potentially. So once that video goes up, we'll do a breakdown of that trailer as well. But it was really just something extra, just a little live action. It was interesting. You know, it had a mansion. It uh, had um, like a, a chick. It had like a, a like a guy who looked kind of like a mobster. And it had some other cool New Orleans stuff. I mean, New Bordeaux stuff in it regarding Mafia 3. So it'll definitely be worth checking out once it comes out sooner rather than later. But like I said, I think it was just premature on um, Mafia 3's part. And, of course, over at, uh, what, uh, 2K. So, <laughs> anyway, so 2K Central's already got their video up. So they're ahead of me. Actually, I think they just posted the uh, trailer, which is something I really don't do. The way I see it is it's better just to go ahead and just throw out the video in a link. And then my video is always a breakdown trailer. But anyways, if you want to check out my breakdown trailers... Postcards, New Bordeaux Tribune, brochures, trailer breakdowns like the one we're about to do. You can check all that out over here in my Mafia playlist. So let's get to it, shall we? Breaking down Lincoln Clay, the Soldier trailer, which just came out this morning. All right, so it opens with Lincoln Clay. Then, of course, it pans past Lincoln Clay to an image of Lincoln Clay. You know, the iconic, you know, poster for Mafia 3 where he has the shotgun. And as it zooms closer into Lincoln Clay's eye, you see the past come to light. Where it all began for Lincoln Clay, his story, at an orphanage. And a lot of the images and video used in this 54-second trailer has been used already. And first off, the uh, reveal trailer back last August. And of course, the one-way road trailer in April, just a few months ago. So you're going to see a lot of video that you've already seen in the previous two trailers. But it's just really cool how they mixed it up in this trailer regarding Lincoln Clay the soldier. So he starts off as an orphan. But then, of course, he's also raised on the streets of New Bordeaux because as an orphan, you don't have a family of your own and you're looking to belong. And a lot of times, you know, orphans end up on the streets because, you know, the orphanage runs out of room and unfortunately some kids get kicked to the curb once they reach a certain age. And then, of course, Lincoln Clay is also an outlaw, obviously, racing around in his badass looking muscle car. Then, of course, he returns from the Vietnam War because he went off to fight in the Vietnam War. He was really good at it, very skilled soldier. He returns home to New Bordeaux to join up with his family. When he was an orphan and on the streets, he came into the graces of Sammy Robinson and his son Ellis, who's right here. They became friends with Lincoln Clay and they basically embraced him as a member of their family. So Sammy Robinson, Ellis, Lincoln Clay and others make up the black mob in Delray. So Lincoln Clay returns from Vietnam rejoins his family, the Black Mob, under Sammy Robinson. And unfortunately, they're betrayed by the mob. The boss, Uncle Sal Marcano, to the left, his son, to the right, another guy. I don't know exactly who that guy is, but we do know the guy to the, to the left is his son. And of course, in the middle is Sal Marcano. By the way, I'm doing a Sal Marcano backstory video coming up on Thursday. I've already done two backstory videos. The first one was on Lincoln Clay, the second one on Vito. Both of those were extremely popular with you guys. So we'll be doing a third backstory video on Sal Marcano coming up on Thursday. Now, this looks like it might be a new image, but I think it's just that 
that you know small image will I'll show you in just a moment just a lot more up close and of course you know he was betrayed by Sal Marcano and the Italian mob Sammy Robinson his son Ellis most of the black mob were killed by the Italian mob under Sal Marcano and Sal's son shot Lincoln Clay in the head and left him for dead but Father James rescued Lincoln Clay and nursed him back to health and several months later or several weeks later, Lincoln Clay awoke from his coma and is out to get revenge against Sal Marcano. In order to do that, he needs to build a new family. Now, what's interesting about this image is it comes from the reveal trailer back in August. Now, a lot has changed regarding the character's looks from the reveal trailer to One Way Road to the E3 trailer. I mean, for one thing, Lincoln Clay looks a little different. I mean, he looks the most similar to what he looked like in the reveal trailer back in August, but Burke looks a little different. Cassandra looks way different now than she looked in the reveal trailer. To be honest, I thought Cassandra looked way better in the reveal trailer, and Vito also looks way different over here at the far right. Now in the reveal trailer, he had gray hair, and he looked like an older version of himself from Mafia 2. Now, obviously, Lincoln Clay his look hasn't changed as much. Burke's changed a little bit. Cassandra's look has changed somewhat. Her hair's not as, as big as it is in this image. But Vito was the most drastic change from the reveal trailer to the One Way Road trailer, and of course, most recently, the E3 trailer. He no longer has a full gray head of hair, and he looks a little bit different than he did in the reveal trailer. But for whatever rhyme or reason, they chose to use this image for this part, to build a new family which includes Vito, the protagonist of Mafia 2, leader of the Rebel Italians, Burke, leader of the Irish, and of course, Cassandra, leader of the Haitians. Together, they form an alliance against Sal Marcano as Lincoln Clay wages war against the Italian mob in order to avenge the deaths of Sammy Robinson, Ellis, the black mob, and take control of New Bordeaux for himself along with Vito, Burke, and Cassandra. And of course, here's some images I thought were interesting because there's a lot of like in-game video that, that quickly goes by in this 54 second video. And this looks like a fight taking place at the Cistern, I believe. You know, one of the territories that you will take over, then decide who you give it to between Vito, Burke, and Cassandra. So uh, Lincoln Clay is beating the shit out of this one mobster here. And another image that I thought was really cool, I haven't seen this one yet, at least I don't think so. Down at Del Rey, at the abandoned amusement park we went over in one of the uh, New Bordeaux brochures regarding Del Rey. So yeah, Lincoln Clay's obviously down here about to uh, murderize this fool for whatever rhyme or reason. Is he connected to Sal Marcano? Most likely. And of course, he's up against the mob. And the mob is a pretty big deal. So that's another thing I will go over in the backstory. The fact that Sal Marcano is the godfather of New Bordeaux. He is the kingpin of the underworld, of the, of the black market. He controls everything when it comes to crime in this city. Unlike Empire Bay Mafia 2, where you had, you know, on top of other gangs, you also had three godfathers. Here in New Bordeaux, you just have one. And sitting at the top is this man, Sal Marcano, the main antagonist of Mafia 3. And of course the video wraps up with the uh, slogan of Mafia 3 or the motto that you hear Lincoln Clay say several times in numerous trailers, family isn't who you're born with, it's who you die for. So there it is my breakdown of the Mafia 3 trailer for Lincoln Clay the soldier and honestly there really wasn't much new here it was just mainly a refresher especially for those who are new to Mafia 3 or just learning about it, either from E3 or from my channel or other channels like 2K Central, for example. And it's just a really quick way for you to get an idea, the story, the premise of Mafia 3 regarding Lincoln Clay, Vito, Burke, Cassandra, as well as Sal Marcano, and exactly what is perhaps going to transpire in the events of Mafia 3. And by the way, the video is linked below in the description section, so feel free and check it out for yourself. And of course, Mafia 3, coming October 7th to Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and PC.